today. Until tomorrow, this is Bob Grant reminding you, uh, your influence counts. Use it. Get Gaddafi. Uh, dear Grant, I hear you're going... That's it, not Monsieur or Monsieur or anything like that. I hear you're going to return to the format which made you so famous, or is it infamous, when you're filling in for Barry Farmer. Try not to be as obnoxious as you used to be. I have always found you rude, insulting, boorish, acerbic, and at times insufferable. In short, a creep. Thank you. Here's another one. Of, uh, Hewlett says, uh, are you going to pour coffee? All right, I will. I'll pour coffee. And for the 48, the United Nations has been primarily a place for people to dump on Israel, and then it became a place for people to dump on the United States. So uh, who the heck wants to see it go on that way? But take ourselves so seriously. No, no, no. Who the heck am I? So I go, Jimmy, I have an idea. Carter, so is that the end of the world? Obviously not. You're on the first song before. You know what? We can all recite all the times we're at the checkout counter. And uh, we had to buy uh, some food that ordinarily Morris would be eating. But we had to buy it because we had no money. And there in front of us was a gentleman or a lady in a fur coat going out to the ever popular El Dorado. Or was it just a, a, a plebeian coupe de ville? Uh, Ma'am, I've heard this story so many times it really has become a cliché, but I thank you. You're on a short trip. You, you think I... Think I, I, think I, think I, think I want to give a quick comment about Todd. Over here in New Jersey... You know, I feel insulted when someone like you calls as though I didn't know. Oh, I'm, I'm glad you did. Over here in New Jersey, people are saying, if only we had a car to run for governor. He is so idolized here because he doesn't knock a lumber to these pressure groups. Just as other fellow said, look at the group that's proposing him. All the losers whose philosophy has brought us to our knees. New York City and the entire nation. Look at that gang of that rogue gallery. Now, just to say that, um, well, let's say, let's say your name is Pamela Canduso, and uh, you're going to send uh, a telephone uh, bill, you're going to pay your telephone bill, and you pay to the same office as, uh, as uh, your name, and your name is Luigi Giambaldo. Well, yes, yeah, I'm so unworthy of any reaction, I'll take the... Uh, the most civilized way out, the kindest way out. Thank you for the call. I'm sure the day will come when, when instead of hearing about Cadillac after Cadillac driving up to a disgorge a food stamp recipient, we will have graduated to Mercedes after Mercedes. But this is still the era of the Cadillac. I think that's great. I think Christmas cards are phony anyway because, you know, uh, husband and wife are... Well, whatever. They go through the list. They say, what about him? No, nah, we, don't, we don't see him anymore. No, this year he doesn't get one. Last year you wanted the guy to get a Merry Christmas. This year he didn't. How oh, phony. Thank you. Dave. Uh, but uh, sitting in, be back tomorrow at 4 o'clock. Until then, I remind you, your influence counts. You it. Yes, yes. <laughs> what? What do you want me to do? Days. They had you eat the tablet on days like a real wacko with that girl there. You should have been out of the news or quit like a man. Well, yeah, and live on what? Hey, stupid, live on what? Ronald Reagan returned a Jimmy Carter's gift to the United States. That's the hell in our home tonight. She's been laying low. I'd like to see her go back to New York. Maybe she's she is not in the uh, as head of the EEOC. She's leaving that post. She is leaving. Yes. Good. You don't think he would keep her in that post? Oh, I hope not, because she, you know, her trick is to say nothing and hope that she'll be. Yeah. No, no, yeah. she has left the post. Leary, I'm very leery of social workers. Oh. Hey, that's a brilliant response. Yeah, there's plenty of them. Hey, uh, you know what, pal? All right, hey, I don't think I like you. How about this? Man, I really, hey, hey, I really, I think you're cool, aren't you? You're making me nervous. How about it, pal? Let's well, go have there's one. There's another rack. You'll get that 120,000. I read it in the paper. Really? Would you send me a clipping? Because I want to show it to my boss. No. Well, okay. Creeping about a budget of $658 billion. Right. We're talking about trying to pair that by $41 billion. And someone's going to come along and worry about $150,000 or $200,000. Right. And I've got news for those people who might be disturbed. 
when this president's term ends, whether it's in 1984 or 1988, Nancy cannot take the White House with her. Who rides the... He is riding a 1947 P. Green Studebaker, license number SOB6969. If you see him, run him over. Get off the phone, you... Uh, the term transit worker makes me laugh because very few people who are paid by the transit authority work. Lord Acton said, we have no eternal enemies, we have no eternal friends. We do, however, have eternal interests. And it is talk shows all the time. Not all the time, here and there. Well, Why are you so frenetic all the time? Frenetic? Yeah, frenetic. I mean, you make okay. me nervous. I'm nervous about well, the I'm wait, I'm they head for tonight. And until Monday at 5.30, this is Bob Grant saying it's been a pleasure to be sitting in for Barry Farber. And until next time, your influence counts. Use it. Get it. Get it. Get it. A, a staunch Jimmy Carter advocate is Anthony Lewis. Even Tom Wicker, even Tom Wicker, has had to find serious fault with Jimmy Carter's conduct. Yes. Yeah. But Anthony Lewis is the only one to defend Jimmy Carter at all costs. I know, I've noticed that. Uh, well, there has to be some misguided people, I guess. You're at WF ahead, please. Was it uh, Mrs. Uh, Adorazzo from uh, Yonkers? No. Was it uh, Mrs. Uh, I'm Shagada from, uh, uh, from, um, let's see, from, uh, Staten Island? No. It was Erwin Brodsky from Manhattan. Can you imagine that? Now, I know some of you younger people who are here at WMCA, you're looking at me like, hey, these guys freak all of But those were in the crazy days. They're gone, but not forgotten. Nope. Ask Ed DiBenedetto about his revved up Benedetto Buick at 205 11 Northern Boulevard in Bayside. Ed DiBenedetto at the Clearview Expressway. 205 11 Northern Boulevard in Bayside. 205 11 Northern Boulevard in Bayside. Let's all try it again. Ready? Ed DiBenedetto, 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 Ed don't forget, stay tuned for Sally. I know she'll want you here. And uh, let's see, until Monday, this is Bob Grant reminding you your influence counts. Use it. Get Gaddafi. For today, here's WMCA's Strauss Communications in New York reminding you to conserve water today while there's still water to conserve. Every drop you waste brings us one drop closer to a severe crisis. Don't you be a drip, be a WMCA water miser, and turn down those faucets today. And get Qaddafi. Three cell your influence counts. Use it. Get Qaddafi. Who? Ed de Benedetto. Who? Ed de Benedetto. Ed de Benedetto. Ed de Benedetto. Ed Benedetto. Ed de Benedetto. Monday. Get Qaddafi. <laughs>